I'd like to give a huge thank you to NewWayEnglish.tv for sponsoring this video. So yeah, this one is about They're going to bring this hyper little brown furry fluffy dog to the house that loves to chew bones and loves to chew shoes and chairs and blankets and sofas and pillows and clothes and candy and uh, we need to have a little talk yeah so what are we gonna call that right, we want to av avoid what is it we want to avoid with this new member of the family now? So we have to have a little talk here because we want to make sure everybody understands what the rules are. We don't want to have any problems. So we don't want to have any, oh, I didn't know, Why do you, you never told me that he couldn't sleep in my bedroom. You know, you never told me. I, I wasn't allowed to give him your steak. You gave him my what? Exactly. Right? Green mistakes. Mistakes. Couple. Yeah. This is a, it's a hard one. You could have got the picture of the office guy sitting there being all mm, trying to figure something out. But we're trying to keep it related to having pets and, and especially dogs. We, we were going to talk about cats and everything else, but we decided there was so much again, we would just stick with dogs this time. The word is confusion, right? And, and confusion really happens with lack of communication, right? Because if you're, if you're thinking this and you believe this, but the other person is thinking that and believing that, and then all of a sudden things are not working and it's like, oh, well, I'm really confused because I thought you saw this and I thought, and I thought, and you thought, well, no, I didn't think that. So <laughs> it causes a lot of confusion. So many families here are more than four or five people. So it's very important to have your little family meetings before you bring pets into the house. You would if you were gonna bring a, a, another family member to the house, you know, why wouldn't you do it with a pet? Right. Yo Johanna, sorry if I say your name wrong. Johanna. The chain, chain like the chain, the thing. The the answer, the answer is chain C H A I N. I train think State maybe it's like a train, train. Tra chain. Yeah, maybe. A chain, 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 chain. I'm not sure what you mean, Johanna. Is it Johanna? L e H O, or is it right here? Yo. Johanna, yeah, Johanna Wulandari, Wulandari, Indonesian maybe? Mm. Not sure. Uh, I'm not sure what you mean by chain. Um, I guess that's an option too. If you all agree that you're going to chain the dog up so that he doesn't harm anything, there's that option too, unfortunately. So please try to write down the answer again and see what we get. Not, not sure what you mean by chain. Okay. Confusion. You want to avoid confusion. And that's not just with pets. You want to avoid confusion at school, at home, with your friends, right? So, I mean, communication is just so important. All right. Here we go.